How do you make money with Airbnb without renting out your office, your bedroom, your home or anything else? Yes, that is right. In today's video, we are going to be talking about how you can make money on Airbnb without actually owning or renting anything. If that sounds like something you are interested in, make sure you keep watching because we are going to dive straight into this. So there is an awesome amount of money that can be made through Airbnb right now. Now, if we come over to Airbnb, you can see there are a lot of nice places or what people also do is something called house hacking. This is where they rent out part of their house to cover the mortgage so they effectively live for free. I don't know about you guys, but I wouldn't like somebody walking around in my own house. I love my personal space. So that just isn't even an option. That is why I'm going to show you how you can literally make thousands of dollars a month on Airbnb without having to rent out your house or owning anything. Because what a lot of Airbnb owners don't realize is that this actually takes a bit of knowledge. A lot of people think that they can just start Airbnb businesses, put up a bunch of random photos and instantly start getting sales. However, that is not true. If we just look at some of these Airbnb listings, take this one for example, the photos on this are absolutely beautiful and it has a good description that has been thought about. Whereas if they just put up a bunch of random photos taken on an iPhone, written out a terrible description in like two minutes, they would get no Nowhere near the amount of sales. And people don't realize that there are a lot of things that you need to do to optimize these listings so that people actually buy them. And this is exactly where the opportunity is for you and me to dive in and actually start making some money. For example, you are watching videos like this right now where I can describe everything that needs to be done in these Airbnb listings to boost them up. And you already know more than probably 50% of these Airbnb owners who just send up random listings and they don't really think to optimize their results. So what you can do is you can actually find people on Airbnb and contact them, you probably would not want to contact this person because this listing looks awesome. But you might reach out to somebody who owns this because the difference in these listings are absolutely crazy. So what you could do is you could contact this person here and you could reach out to her and say, I will do absolutely everything. I will put the pictures up. I will even talk to the customer. I will do absolutely everything and you will split some of the profit. You may think that this person would not be interested. Maybe they would want to do all the work themselves, but it's literally a win, win, win situation. It's a win for this person because they get everything done for them. It's a win for you because you get paid and it's a win for the customer because they get a better experience with Airbnb. To go a step further and find somebody who will definitely want to work with you, you can even look for people who are kind of failing Airbnb. And by this, I mean people who haven't got any sales yet. I'm talking about people who don't have any reviews, any sales, and they are genuinely desperate to get their first sales on Airbnb. If you go to them and say, hey, I can get you your first sales, I can get you your first reviews on the map, they will be more than happy to split the profit with you. It is literally a no brainer for the person who owns these Airbnbs because they don't have to deal with the customer. They don't have to deal with anything and they are only going to pay you when they are guaranteed profit. Now you might be wondering how much can you actually make with this method? And the answer is usually 20 to 40% of the profit. Now you might be thinking that that is not a lot of money, but let's just go with one of these random examples. If we go for this one, that will cost three and a half thousand pounds. This is probably like three and a half thousand dollars. But let's say the owner of this is paying one thousand dollars per month to actually own this place. That would mean that two thousand dollars per month would be profit. So this means on the low end, you could get 20% of this, which works out to $400. You don't own this property. You don't have to go out there and do house hunting and look for properties to rent out. Out, you are literally getting a percentage of the sale just for optimizing these listings. 
Now, I'm going to let you into a sneaky little secret of how you can do all of this in literally five minutes. Outsourcing. If you don't know what outsourcing is, it's literally awesome, okay? So, let's say, for example, that you go through and you find somebody who will work with you on Airbnb. What you would do is you would look at the property in question, for example, this, and you would work out what your profit would be. So let's use this one for example again and say we are getting $400 in profit. What you could then do is come over to this website called fiverr.com and then you can see a few offers here. I will improve and optimize your Airbnb listing in one day. You have this Fiverr's choice of $100. So even if you go with this expensive option, you are still going to keep $300 in profit even though you outsourced the entire project. And that is the beautiful thing with this, and especially outsourcing, is you do not need to do any of the work apart from finding people who you actually want to work with. After that, you can just outsource the rest of the work and it is completely passive income. I have seen people online use this exact business model of Airbnb optimization in order to make five to ten thousand dollars every single month just by doing these optimization jobs. Now, I have no idea if they are outsourcing this, but it would be kind of stupid if they weren't. The reason this works so well is you are partnering with people who don't want the headache of running an Airbnb business. You take all that away from them, you optimize the listings and do the boring stuff and they will be more than happy to share the profits as you have taken so much of their headache away. The beautiful thing is this literally has no income limit, especially if you are outsourcing and you are not doing any of this work yourself. You can just come on here and keep getting more and more clients and scale this up month over month. Now, making money with Fiverr is an absolutely awesome way to make money online. However, in my opinion, the best way to make money online is through a business model called affiliate marketing. Now, this is what I did. And in my first month, I made $7.2,000. If you want to learn exactly how I did this, you can click the first link down in the description. I made a video and I will tell you more about it. Anyway, that was how to make money with Airbnb. I hope you guys enjoyed.